hello everyone welcome back to another video if you're new here my name is Kyra do not forget to like comment and subscribe so today we're gonna get ready for a lunch day y'all yes girl lunch day and I'm super excited because I just love doing daytime things especially in the summertime especially when the weather is nice because y'all know Atlanta just got that iffy weather I wanted to take y'all through the steps of doing my hair and makeup y'all been asking me because I've been doing these sleek ponytails so I'm like let's just do a get ready with me together but first I do want to pick out my outfit and I just been doing a little damn job so I just want to do a small little haul from Nordstrom and they are sponsoring this video if you know me and if you aren't new you know Nordstrom is my go-to store when it comes to adding pieces to my summer wardrobe whether it's I'm about to go travel if I'm about to go to work I know at Nordstrom I'll definitely find the right piece especially to serve a look so I love that they're always going above and beyond for their customers like me girl because I'm always in there shopping and also I love that Nordstrom is committed to serving their customers with their closer to you promise so basically that stands for they want to make sure the pieces that you buy from their store are closer to you we need an item at a certain amount of time with the curbside pickup or if something isn't working out for you size wise they do have tailors available in store so you'll be able to find the perfect big girl and they also provide stylus as well just in case you you know you don't really aren't too sure when it comes to styling a piece you just want a second opinion they do have stylus available for you at Nordstrom so I'm gonna be showing y'all the pieces that I recently picked up to add to my summer wardrobe and also they are having an anniversary sale coming up July 17th so make sure you take advantage and everything that I show you will be linked down below let's get into this haul I did pick up a couple of accessories and I am going to another Renaissance concert okay and I seen these sunglasses and I could not pass them up and they look so good on me I was a little iffy because my head shape is like weird but <gasps> and she wears a sunglasses pair like this but this one is probably so much cheaper like I said Nordstrom has all the pieces oh my god god they look so good oh my god i love them uh, i'm about to serve uh, i'm about to serve i'm about to serve yeah yeah <laughs> the love on top look baby because you're the one that i love perfect so if you're going to see beyonce you need to grab these the look will be eating so if y'all know me, you know I'm a gold jewelry girl. So I definitely had to pick up some cute hoops. Okay, and these are by the Open Edit. Look how gorgeous the spiral is on these hoops. Gorgeous. Yes. Mm. I don't have a solid, just plain gold, chunky bangles. This is gonna add everything that I need. Whenever I wear this, I know this is going to take my look to the next level because it's not doing too much, but still a statement at the same time. Okay, so this is the next outfit I put together. So I have on this cargo skirt and I just love that this doesn't restrict my butt because I have issues with that. This is a size large and I love the oversized pockets on here. It just really gives you that cargo touch and it does have an adjustable strap you can adjust it to your liking i have on this free people tank top i love a good halter neck for my wardrobe so when i seen this i was like oh yes add to cart because i just love the little details it has on the and it's an off-white color it's not pure white it's like cream with the army green you know it's giving me that soldier um i wish i would have sized down in the tank top because it is a little oversized but that's okay this halter neck crop striped knit tank top which i love i think i like a crop top better with the skirt just so it can show body i just got this shoulder pad top i love the details so simple so perfect for a date night and it's cropped and this is a very modest top it's still covered up but it still gives you those flirty fun vibes way if i was a set this is the set I would be. Look how gorgeous this color is. It's like an olive nude. It's so beautiful. I love the pocket detail on here. I am living for this set. This, oh my God. And it's so comfortable, y'all. 
so comfy, so effortless. I love a set. I love that the top is cropped, so it definitely can serve a little body. But I am gonna go get these taken in. Oh my God, this is going to serve one, two. Nordstrom has the summer styles. So this is the outfit I'm gonna wear today. Are the flip over trouser pants. This beautiful chocolate color. And then I paired it with this super cute basic rib tank top. And I just love the fit of this. This is a small medium. Love the edgy touch of this, which is the flip over, which I've been looking for a pair of these and Nordstrom came through. And they fit pretty well that I can get away with for today, but I probably am gonna take it to the tailor just to cinch in my waist just a little bit. But other than that, I do like the oversized comfort feeling of these pants. These are bomb. This is just what I was looking for to add to my summer wardrobe and the pants are super breathable. So comfy. This basically has been my summer wardrobe. A basic white tank top and some trousers. Love, love, love. That is it for my Nordstrom haul. Thank you so much Nordstrom for sponsoring this portion of the video. Now we're gonna get into the makeup and the hair. Oh, and I also am gonna leave my open edit earrings on, but I am gonna take them off while I do my makeup. <laughs> so let's get into it. Oh my God, I'm super excited for this day. I'm gonna slay the day. I better find your love. It's time to do hair and I've been really proud of myself because I've been doing these slick back ponytails that be coming out so cute. And I'm gonna show y'all how I achieve this look at home. You're gonna save so much money, especially if you're somebody who loves ponytails. This is right up my alley and I love, love doing slick back ponytails because it's hot outside. And also, I just love my hair out of my face. A middle part ponytail. Sometimes I'll do it on a freshly wet hair. Kind of like doing my slick back ponytails on dirty hair. The first thing I'm gonna do is part my hair into a middle part. Middle parts just make a more chic look. I'm just gonna leave my baby hairs out. So then I like to section the top part of my hair off. I like to part my hair into sections just to really give me that sleek look and just get every strand of hair inside the ponytail. Oh my God, I need to shave. <laughs> I'm just gonna part another section in my hair. So I have three sections. I'm gonna take this gel, I'm just gonna go in. And then I'm just gonna brush up and make sure every strand of hair is up and slicked. What I've really been enjoying using is a wax stick to slick down my hair when I do these slick backs because it really just gives those little hairs that are stubborn and sometimes gel just doesn't do it for me. In this section, I'm really making sure my edges are slicked back. This is what's gonna really snatch the face. And I love doing my own ponytails because I can really control the tightness. And as these hair ties build up, um, your ponytail is gonna get tighter. So there's no need to um, put the ponytail tight. What I'm gonna do is just slick this straight back. She is sleek. I'm going to slick my baby hairs down. I like to use two edge controls. I like to mix them because my hair never stays down for some reason. And when it comes to baby hairs, it's all about the flick in a wrist. And then if you wanna make that curl, just take the rat tail part of it and flip it over into a circle. This ponytail is a slip ponytail. Slip on your actual ponytail. I'm gonna brush this out first. This is a little nappy. 
Cause she's been getting a wear, honey. Did buy two of these just in case because I really didn't know the quality. This is okay. It's not too bad, but it sheds a lot. What I'm gonna do is braid my hair in the back so the ponytail will be able to slip on my actual ponytail effortlessly. And you wanna do it tight. Cause if it's not tight, it can get bunched up. So we're braided up. Now it's time to slip this baby on. I'm just gonna take the comb and apply it on top of my ponytail. And I am gonna secure with a bobby pin as well, just so it doesn't droop down. Cause with just the comb, it like droops down a little bit, but I want it to hang a little higher. <laughs> I like that it comes with the actual leave out piece to wrap around the ponytail. What I'm gonna do is go around the ponytail and I am gonna add edge control on the hair just so it's secure and I don't have any little flyaways from the hair um, and that it lays flat. <laughs> hair is done so now we're gonna move into makeup and i'm gonna keep it really light today um so we're gonna do like skin tint a little bit concealer nothing too major but still a nice dewy glowy summertime look but i want to go in with this nars magic hour this eye brightener Illum i wanted to try this out just because i don't really like to wear makeup on an everyday basis but when i do i want my under eyes concealed bright and I got this in the color Magic Hour. But I'm just gonna place it on my under eyes. And I wanted to get something that was more, a little bit closer to my skin tone. So it's easy to wear on an everyday basis if I just wanna wear this instead of just concealer. Oh, she's bright. She's bright. I like her. I don't know if y'all can really tell on camera. But I'm just using a light hand. I can really see the brightness. Then I'm gonna go in with the Kosas <laughs> Vitamin Infused Skin Enhancer. This gives my skin a nice glow underneath my base, whether it's foundation or a skin tint. I just like the glow. And it just gives you a nice illuminated touch to your skin. Look at how nice and dewy that is. Now I'm gonna take my Chanel Water Finish Complexion Touch. I'm gonna apply this to my hands. This makes my skin look like skin. I just don't wanna look cakey in the summer. I'm gonna go in with the Hourglass and the NARS Creamy Concealer. And this one is more my skin tone and this is like a brightening one. So I just like to mix the two to make the perfect concealer combination. Right underneath my eye. While that's drying, I just went ahead and filled in my eyebrows with my eyebrow tint. I'm gonna add some on my eyelids right here. I like to go up just so my face is snatched. I'm not gonna bake, just say. Think I made myself dizzy. 
take a little bit on my waterline, but not too much. Literally just a little bit. Right and I'm just gonna go in with a little bit more bronzer. gives us that light back and when I'm doing this I'm literally doing it with a light hand because like I said I don't want to look too cakey I just want it to be an effortless bronzy latte look it is looking so good so I just added some brightening powder um, just in the middle part right here and I'm just patting it into my face I'm just gonna set my face with the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Setting Spray. For highlight, I'm just gonna add the Glowgasm Charlotte Tilbury in High Blush. And this just is pretty copper blush highlight. And I like to just apply this with my fingers. Oh my God, this is so cute. Oh my god, this is the perfect summer look. Oh my god. And me doing makeup like this on like a daily basis like this just helps me get more practice. Because I don't want to look cakey. I just want to look like myself. And I want my skin to shine through because it's doing amazing. I'm gonna go in with the Charlotte Tilbury lip cheat and this is in the color foxy brown and I'm gonna go in with the YSL candy glaze I've been loving this as y'all can see I need to re-up so I'm gonna just take my finger I have on a tank top, I kind of want my skin to look glossy and hydrated and dewy and glowy. I'm going to add the Tom Ford Soleil Blanc onto my chest area. I'm actually going to apply it on my hands because I really don't want it on my shirt. This just smells so good. And it gives you a nice subtle shimmer to your skin. If you don't have this already... Girl, what are you doing? I'm gonna do the Forbidden Games by Killian. I haven't worn this in a while. I have so many perfumes, y'all. I need to start like bringing them out. This has a peach undertone to it, so I do want to. I was gonna pair it with the Tom Ford Bitter Peach because this is my favorite summertime scent. Um, but I kind of wanna. You know what? We're gonna do a bit. I mix it with the Mason Francis gentle fluidity gold i haven't worn this in so long oh my god all right y'all so we smell good look good okay the look came together so nice um but yeah i just have on the same outfit that y'all seen in the beginning of the video and then i just paired it with my white bag and then uh i love these earrings so cute but yes y'all everything will be linked down below i have to go but thank you so much for getting ready with me i love y'all so much and i'll see you in the next video bye